Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft is rolling out the first and anniversary feature update for Windows 11 this year, version 22H2, also codenamed Sun Valley 2, as many of you may know. And we are expecting to see the feature update rollout possibly in October later on this year. So if you want to know and check if your Windows 10 and or 11 device is compatible and ready for the upcoming Windows 11 feature update, then it's actually very simple to do. And you can just check in the registry on both operating systems to find out if you are compatible to receive the upgrade. Now it goes without saying that if you are currently um, running Windows 11 on your device, that your device um, will get the version 22H2 feature update because at this stage, there are no system requirement changes to be upgraded from the original release, which is the uh, current stable version of Windows 11, version 21H2, to the feature update version 22H2. So this will mainly apply uh, for those of you still running Windows 10. But if you are interested, you can check in the registry on both Windows 10 and 11. And that's, of course, if you are comfortable and confident enough to fiddle around in the registry. Now, to get to the registry, um, uh, the simplest would be basically just to right click on your start menu, click on run, in run enter reg edit, click on OK and this will open the registry editor as many of you will know. Now the path um, that we are looking for is buried quite deep in the registry. So the simplest would be to copy and paste the following path into the address bar at the top of the registry and I will leave uh, the registry path in the descriptions for easy reference for you just to copy and paste. So copy and paste that path in, in the address bar and then you just hit enter and that will take us to the folder we are looking for just move that over and that is target version upgrade experience indicators and we then have to click on the nr22h2 folder which will open up that folder in the right hand pane where we get all our different keys and values now the first key we are looking for is called red reason and that's found over here, red reason. And the value should be set to none. So if that value is none on your device, then you will receive and you are compatible to get and receive the Windows 11 version 22H2 feature update. Uh, if it doesn't say none, uh, then um, it will have the reasons why, like as an example, it will say TPM2 missing or um, secure boot or um, just indicators like that. But if it says none, then you know you will receive the Windows 11 version 22H2 feature update. And then some other values, just to double check, that you can also look for and keys are the uh, UPGEX, um, that key, and that should be set to green. And the UPGX uh, U, that should also be set to green. So um, if both these um, keys, UPGEX and UPGX, you are set to green, uh, those values are at green, then you will receive the uh, 22H2 uh, feature up update. Uh, if these say red, then your device won't be compatible. So to be compatible on both Windows 10 and 11 to receive the upgrade, a red reason needs to say none, and these two uh, keys need to have the value of green, and that means you are compatible, as mentioned, to get the upgrade. Now, just on a side note, um, if you are still running Windows 10. Yeah, uh, in the left-hand pane under the folder target version upgrade experience indicators, um, you may see other folders like 21H, Windows 10 version 21H2, and that's if you are running an older version of Windows 10, so just take note of that. But the folder you're looking for to, to look if you want to be upgraded and can be upgraded is NR22H2. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.